are on our way to Athens. Then I got a chicken biscuit. Same. First time I'm getting a chicken biscuit. Yeah, it's gonna be good. We're about to take some photos. Got my Instagram husband. <laughs> um, Instagram Live, it's literally so new. Like, just drop around the tripod. Good morning guys, it's Vlogmas Day 12 and we, but before we go to Athens we have to pick up my daughter, Sophie, the dog. <laughs> Ryan has his cold brew ready for him. And I like four hours of sleep last night. What did you go to so sleep? I was like punch me in the ribs while sleeping. I did not. I'm whispering I'm a evil, graceful really evil things to me when you're asleep. No I didn't. <laughs> So I got up at 6.10 this morning because I'm going to have brunch with Brooke right when I get to Athens, like right at 11. We're leaving at 8. We're going to get there around like 10.30 or something like that. Well, hopefully it's shorter than two hours, but I just kind of gave me some wiggle room. We're taking Ryan's friend back to UGA as well. So we're going to meet him at Chipotle. Then we're going to drive over to Holly Berry and pick up Sophie and head to Athens. <laughs> Sophie. Oh, no, that's a man's generic place for all the girls. It's a code name. Trust me, yes. So I'm here at Mama's Boy, and it literally took five minutes for them to realize I was, like, there to put my name on the list. Like, they smiled at me and everything, and they were like, hey, you know, and I was like, can I put my name on the list? And they're like, oh, yeah, sorry. It's like, what the heck? What do you think I'm here for? But, oh, there she is. Thanks for dropping off me off, Fry. Love you. Bye. So we're at Mama's Boy right now. We have a pretty view. You have a tripod on yours? That's so cool. Yes. No, because, oh like, it's, like, so stable when yeah. it's, like, on it. No, it's so true. Yeah, so. I got the, the, the gorilla pod for my main camera. This is, yeah, this is a gorilla pod. Oh, it is? Yeah. I have it from, like, my, you know, DSLR. Yeah. But it's hard to hold up a DSLR. Oh, so yeah, even with sure. that, it's, like, a little unstable. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, so what'd coffee. you get? I got iced coffee with soy milk. And she filled it up to the top with iced coffee, so now I like it. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> yeah. But it's okay. And then I got a chicken biscuit. Same. It's the first time I'm getting chicken biscuit. Yeah, it's gonna be good. This stuff is like really good. This yes, raspberry yes, stuff. Yes. It yeah. tastes like magic. I don't know. Oh. Let me know. <laughs> I don't know what this is. It's cute. Like, oh, it's okay. <laughs> My video might be up before you or yours will be up before. Girl, I don't know. I'm so backed I'll up. Low eventually, but yum. Look how good this looks. So healthy, guys. <laughs> Literally. Fitness. Yes. Hashtag vegan. Hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to take some photos. Got my Instagram husband. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> okay. I, I, I use the self timer feature. It's really <laughs> nice. No. Breakfast was so good. That chicken biscuit, man. So, so yummy. Now Ryan gets to eat his chicken biscuit. I got him one to go. Because he just took pictures of me and Brooke, so. Um, Little present. He earned it. Okay, yeah, let's do it. So we're gonna probably go to a coffee shop type thing. Yeah, we're going to get to. I don't know. Um, Brooke said like sip is really good. I don't know. Where did you want to go? Uh, we're going to walk back here. Okay. So we're going to go to like a coffee shop so he can study and I can do editing. I need to edit. Like vlog on vlog on vlog on vlog. I'm so behind. I'm just like so disappointed in myself but also I'm like I was traveling. I didn't even think I was going to drive home on Saturday. I just like ended up being like okay there's no really point for me to stay like an extra day here. So I packed up my stuff and just left on Saturday. So I have a Disney vlog to edit and then I filmed a haul video, a try and haul, by the way. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna go do some studying slash work, get stuff done. Okay guys, this is um, Instagram Live. It's literally so new, like it's pretty much like five minutes new. Shout out to Margaret. <laughs> Um, but yeah, basically I'm just trying it out. It's like an on your Instagram story. So I don't know what happened to Vlogmas. I'll tell you what happened to Vlogmas. So I'm currently charging my camera on my computer, which I don't even know if it's still charging while I'm recording, but 
If you guys tuned in to the live stream on Instagram, let me know by commenting on this video because that was so much fun. It was really cool. Definitely gonna do it more often. So I was charging my camera and it was charging so slow. I don't know if it's like the charger or if it's just regularly slow. We are gonna go to like a southern store. What do you what do you call them, Ryan? An outfitter. An outfitter? Okay, well, like a clothing store, like, you know, preppy brands like Southern Tide and stuff like that. We had one at home called Henry and Pearl, and like every single time I had to get him a present, I would just go straight there and get him like t-shirts and cute stuff like that. So I want to go into this one just to look at everything, but um, I finally edited my Vlogmas Day 8, 9, and 10. Um, it's like one combined vlog. 14 minutes long. I thought it was going to be so long, but I'm glad it's kind of short because I know with everyone's vlog misses like coming out right now, it just kind of gets overwhelming. So it's good that it's not too long. I'm excited to get back on track with like actual separate day vlog miss because like I think I like them better than, com than combined day vlogs because I feel like combined days are just like very scattered brain. We're here at Empire Cell. It's a little sneak peek because I don't think I'm gonna vlog inside. Ooh, <gasps> True Grits. That's my favorite Wait, jacket. Ryan has this ratchet ass watermelon in his front yard. Apparently he has a watermelon patch right near his, his home. <laughs> what? That's disgusting. Someone's, someone needs to take care of that. Yeah, that's what does. <laughs> Sophie. Sophie! Vlogging on my iPhone because something happened. Brian will explain later. But we're at the gas station right now. And this guy is about to film him. He just asked him to be on camera, I guess. I guess it's for the news or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Alright, sir. So, uh, yeah, the... The big announcement is the sheriff said on Friday that from now on, because there's too many accidents, apparently it went up by 25% this year, that uh, no more warnings would be issued. That his, his guys are just going to be out there getting on people's cases about the littlest stuff and everybody's getting a ticket. What's your reaction? What do you think? Um, I think it could be a good thing or a bad thing. If it saves lives, obviously it's a, it's a positive. Your personal observations, is this uh, becoming a place where there's a lot of crazy driving, a lot of accidents that you could see? Um, I've seen a few, actually a lot, of, I got a, uh, my student in UNGO County are here and there's been multiple accidents where it's caused people to be late to school and uh, a lot of like reckless driving, also on that main um, experiment station road and there's been a lot of reckless driving on there and a few wrecks, so. Is that bucket list crossed off? To be on the news? Yeah, I probably won't put me on there because I mumbled. No. Why? I think you did well. Really? Yeah. So, would you like to explain? Um. So I went in to get to pay for my gas with cash. Not that. Why we haven't been vlogging. Um, well, sorry, I'm on a high right now. Well, <laughs> cool. Um, so we were outside running with Sophie. This is the new. This is the new land, by the way. You can't tell the quality. Um, we were outside running with Sophie, and she handed me the camera on the tripod so she could go run with her. And I turned it upside down, and it just dropped right off the tripod. And the cement. I actually kicked it first my foot to try to break the landing and I picked it up and the lens just kind of stuck up a little bit so I popped it back in and it looked completely fine. I don't, I, there was nothing wrong with it. Except we turned the thing on it says like can't read lens like put on properly and I'm like it is on properly and this lens works. So we took the Best Buy. The Best Buy guy was like oh call Sony you know I don't know what to do. We got a lot of help, you know, like for cleaning my fucking lens off with a fucking <laughs> microfiber and putting it back on. Like, I don't know if I was do that, you know. And, um, <laughs> so I called, call Sony, they're closed. Best Buy doesn't have one within 250 miles of us. We can't get one. And now we're going to the school library to print off a thing to send the, to send the uh, lens back. We're gonna use the nice lens to vlog for this break, I guess. I just bought this same exact lens like a month oh, ago. Look, 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 look. Oh my god, is someone's car, car on fire? Yeah. What the hell? That's scary. Wait, wait. 
That's like really on fire too. Holy crap. Wait, park far away from it. That's yeah, scary. You cool. should know. Like this little help thing. You should probably run into the library and be like, um, someone's car is catching on fire. Shout out Margaret Martin. My friend's car caught on fire senior year. Um, there were jokes about her like passing the aux cord and catching on fire, which was really funny actually, but it wasn't funny because it was her car and I caught on fire. It's pretty funny if you know Margaret. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it would happen to Margaret. In other news, speaking of news, I'm going to be on the news during the local Athens area. <laughs> I'm be on CBS 46 because I got interviewed about the sheriff's new rule of not giving people warnings, only getting them tickets. And I had to speak about it on the camera while I was pumping my gas. Senna was visibly upset in the passenger seat about this new rule. <laughs> but we got here bowling, cars on fire, printing stuff. It's been a good day. A good day? The eventful day. Yeah, I'll say that. Ryan tweeted from my phone. Ryan is asking me where I want to eat. Should I tell him or say I don't care? So I have 44 votes right now. Sorry, it's a bit close up. <laughs> no. I have 45 votes right now. 56% um, says I don't care. 44% says tell him. I bet all of that 44% are boys and the 56% are <laughs> girls. <laughs> so I'm just gonna say, I don't care. And if you ever know a girl, especially one like this, mm -hmm. you know, if she's having a rough day, you buy her sushi. That's why we're going to get sushi. Are we? Yeah, where do you want to go? I don't care. You want steak or sushi? I guess we can go to Rusan's. I just told you. You're to Rusan's? I went against my Twitter Same. poll. I went to Rusan's. I went against my people on Twitter, and now he's mad at me. So yeah, I want to go to Rusan's. I want to go to Rusan's. Got sushi. Here, Bar Ryan, we only serve up the finest eggnog. Um, this is Southern Comfort eggnog, vanilla spice. This is a um, very rare delicacy in many parts of the world. Snog's never had it. What a change. You know it's good? Yeah, but like. Like what? So this isn't traditional? Vanilla spice, it's just like ice cream. Sorry. Damn. But like what do you eat this with? You just drink it. Usually there's alcohol in it. Like, uh, like you would just eat this with your dinner? Or drink this with your dinner? No, it'd be like getting like a milkshake. Oh. Uh, it tastes like I'm drinking heavy whip, like whipping cream. Milk, milk and ice cream. Not too, but like, I feel like if you just like whip this up, it could be like whipped cream. Like, why is this only a Christmas thing? Because I think traditional has like a mini day too. Oh. So I'm teaching Ryan how to edit my vlogs because he's gonna edit his part that he filmed of what? Would you film? Me wrapping her Christmas gifts. <laughs> you braid that armpit over here, over there. <laughs> that matters, Ryan? Have you ever tried braiding that armpit here? Try I wear him in cornrows sometimes. <laughs> He's learning blading and selecting and everything. Um, Blazer. Laser. And it took him a while, but he's getting there. So Sophie's annoying of. us. Sophie. She keeps bringing her balls back. And I keep trying to hide them from her, but... Just know, who was all you let me love, boy, what you know? Who was all you let me love, boy, what you know?